Too often, these black market guns are found at crime scenes. And too often, these black market guns are responsible for heartbreaking tragedies. The Justice Department announced a plan Thursday to close the so-called gun show loophole, requiring tighter background checks for gun sales online and at gun shows. The new rule expands the definition of licensed firearms dealers and requires sellers who sell guns to, quote, predominantly earn a profit to get a federal gun dealer license and run background checks. As a result, an estimated 23,000 previously unlicensed sellers will be impacted. The new background check rules are set to take effect in 30 days. Attorney General Merrick Garland calling it an historic step. Under this regulation, it will not matter if guns are sold on the Internet, at a gun show, or at a brick-and-mortar store. If you sell guns predominantly to earn a profit, you must be licensed and you must conduct background checks. This regulation is a historic step in the Justice Department's fight against gun violence. It will save lives. The new rule is facing pushback and potential legal challenges, with critics labeling it unconstitutional. In response, Senators John Cornyn and Tom Tillis are proposing a joint resolution to contest the rule, giving Congress 60 days to act. Cornyn, a gun rights advocate and a supporter of the 2022 Bipartisan Safer Communities Act, where these new rules originated, has criticized the administration for overreaching, saying law-abiding gun owners are not the problem. The White House reports that about 22 percent of American-owned guns were bought without background checks.